Want to send it over now, right off the top, to WSAV's Daisy Kershaw. She continues our team coverage live with what it looks like out on the roads this morning. Daisy, good morning to you. Good morning, Kim and Ben. So as you can see here behind me, I'm at the intersection of Pooler Parkway and Highway 80, and there is evidence of those strong winds Kyle was just talking about. Uh, right here, you can see this is the kinds of hazards we are talking about that we are seeing out here this morning. A traffic light has come down at this intersection uh, due to those strong wind gusts, and, and over here, the, the traffic lights are still uh, blinking, flashing. Cars are having to queue and wait at this intersection to make sure that they can safely pass. So, you know, these are these kinds of uh, dangerous conditions that we want drivers, people commuting this morning to, to look out for and to be aware of. And that's not the only thing we're seeing. We've seen power outages across the affected areas, many without power this morning. Um, lots of debris on the roads in general, things, hazards like this. Uh, we're seeing materials blowing around. And so we're, we're really uh, knowing that drivers and people who are out this morning need to be extremely cautious and safe as, as the strong winds continue. Uh, just yesterday or uh, earlier in Toombs County, um, the Toombs, count, uh, Toombs County Fire Station uh, was unusable after strong winds hit. Three firefighters inside the station, one in Vidalia, were able to walk out unharmed, but there was damage sustained to the fire station. And not far from there, um, a, home, a homeowner had to hide under uh, their stairs uh, as those same winds damaged uh, his roof and blew down trees in his yard. And these are the kinds of conditions we're seeing as a result um, of this weather, of these, of these weather conditions. And so as a reminder, if you do have anything that may be loose or able to become airborne, a lot of us are still taking down Christmas decorations. Do be cautious of that and, and be aware what's what's in and around your property. Um, but also, if you are going outside, know that these kinds of strong gusts, just as, as Kyle mentioned, these 40, 50 mile per hour winds, they, they can take, take down trees and power lines. And as, as we're seeing here, this kind of debris is dangerous. It's going to be over the roadway. So be cautious this morning and stay safe. Live in Pooler, Daisy Kershaw, WSAV News 3, on your side.